hold a seashell up to your ear and you'll hear the ocean. You might have heard someone tell you that before, and you might have even tried it. If you were standing at the beach, then you probably had a good chance of hearing the ocean. But what if you were miles away from any body of water? The ocean clearly isn't around, so if it's not the sound of the ocean you hear, then what sound is it? To find out, we're going to dive into some shell acoustics and resonance. The sound you hear from the shell is mainly produced by the ambient noise around it. Sound waves that make their way into the shell continually bounce off the hard, smooth surface and eventually make their way back out. If you were listening inside the shell while you were at the beach, you would actually hear the ocean as the sound waves travel in and out of the shell. If you listen to the same shell at the top of a mountain, however, you just hear the sounds of the top of the mountain. So why does it still seem to sound like the ocean even when you're nowhere near it? That has to do with the pressure waves created by the air entering the shell. As sound pushes air into the shell, the air gets slightly compressed creating a region of high pressure, then springs back out creating a region of low pressure. Air then rushes back toward the region of low pressure and the cycle repeats. An object that produces this type of behavior is known as a Helmholtz resonator. A Helmholtz resonator is simply a container with a hole used to vibrate a gas at a certain frequency. The closed shape and space inside the shell causes the air inside to move back and forth or oscillate. As sound waves enter, certain frequencies are amplified by resonance, which produces a sound very similar to ocean sounds. In fact, other Helmholtz resonators will produce a similar sound. Try putting your ear to the opening of an empty bottle or a cup. The pitch may be different, but the effect will be the same. Next time you come across an empty shell, listen closely and appreciate some shell acoustics. You may hear the frequencies of sound around you that you may have otherwise missed. It's just another way resonance affects the sounds we hear. If you'd like to know more about resonance, check out that video on the right. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. I'd also like to get your suggestions about future topics, so please leave those or anything else that you want to say down in the comments below. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you all so much for watching. For now, have a great day, stay safe, and see you guys next time.